Good morning guys and welcome back to another vlog. I think I'm going to try and do a daily vlog today but we will see. It is Sunday morning, it's like just after 10am. I've been up since like 6.30 just getting stuff done. Had a really productive morning which was awesome. But now I'm going to go run some errands and I thought I would show you my outfit of the day and we'll go say hello to the rest of the squad plus Brendan who are all here in the house this morning eating pancakes. <laughs> so this is my outfit. I have this white t-shirt from Princess Polly, my denim jacket with rose embroidered on the sleeves, and this is from Zaful. My jeans are from Cotton On, and my shoes are from City Beach. And that's my little outfit. Let's go say hi to everyone. Hello. Good morning! Hello. Brennan hasn't been in the vlog for so long, so like, welcome I back. I don't know what you're talking about, I don't care, I'm part of the squad. <laughs> But I just want to say good morning. <laughs> Everyone's having pancakes. It's just a family morning here in the squad house. So, the first errand that I have to run is I'm actually going to resign from one of my jobs, which is actually really sad to me. <laughs> As you guys know, I got a new job a few months ago. A lot of you guys were asking me why I got a new job and like what the new job is and blah, blah, blah. And I often just say, I don't really want to talk about work on my channel because it's just like a lot of complications can come along with it if you don't talk about it the right way. And I never wanted to talk badly about my jobs because I really love both of them. But the reason why I got a new job was just because I wasn't really getting enough hours at my first job. And obviously I've moved out of home and I need to support myself and my first job wasn't able to support me in the way that I really wanted it to. But I also loved the job so, so much and I loved every single person that worked there and I didn't want to quit. So for a while I was kind of maintaining the two jobs but it just became really difficult and my second job that I recently got was just offering me enough hours for me to just work there and I just feel like I'm kind of being more of a burden on my first job than I am being a help like I hardly work there anymore and it's just like not helpful for me to be there and them giving me shifts and me just having to say no all the time like it's I just feel so bad doing that and so I think it's just like best oh, it sounds like so like dramatic but it's like best for everyone if I quit but I also like I said I love every single person there so this is really sad for me and I've also been at that job for five and a half years over five and a half years which is so crazy to me I was 14 when I started and I'm 20 years old now and it's like the end of an era for me I feel like and I'm just like so sad because they're literally like a second family to me I grew up with that job and I'm so sad to be leaving but I've written my resignation letter which is like my formal letter but I've also got a little card here that I wrote for the managers because I just wanted to say thank you because I feel like I've been so blessed to have such an incredible job and not only are my managers and just like the people who work there just a great team to work with but they're also just great people in general and I've just loved every second I've been able to spend at that job like I genuinely just feel so blessed so I'm gonna go resign which is really sad but like it just needs to be done and uh, I'm just gonna also walk around the shops for a bit because so where I used to work my old first job was in a shopping center and I would always just go like have a look at the shops after work or before work or during my break and I was just like surrounded by shops all the time and whatever but now um, my new job it's not in a shopping center and I haven't been shopping in I don't even remember the last time I went shopping or just like even window shopping like just had a look around like I go to Kmart sometimes and I do my grocery shopping, but I haven't just like walked around Cotton On or like Valley Girl or Supre or I want to get some things from Kaiser Craft. Like I haven't done that in so long. So that's what I'm going to do this morning. But there's a little update for you guys. Let's uh, chuck on some bangers. I've been totally obsessed with my Me at 14 playlist. It's so lame and so cringy, but um, it's... Oh, and you know what I should actually do? I should listen to Kanye West's new album. Also, is it pronounced like ye or like ye? Because I feel like it'd be like ye because it's like Kanye, like Y-E, ye. But I don't know. Let me know. But my Me at 14 playlist is like Five Seconds of Summer, The Vamps, and One Direction, which and um, Justin Bieber, which is like what I listened to when I was 14. And it just brings back so many incredible memories and like definitely recommend checking it out if you haven't already. I'm in Target and they have the cutest home decor right now. They are killing it with the fake plants. Like they look so cute. Except this one is like really cute but it looks like so fake. Like it's so clear that it's fake but like look at that. I don't know like where I'd put it or what I'd use it for but it's so cute. Oh like this. That is just so cute. So many things that are just so cute. I love this pillow. I think it's so adorable but like wouldn't match my theme. Haul. I went to a lot of shops. I didn't buy a lot. I went to Kaiser Craft, which is like one of my favorite stores ever. 
and I got like a bunch of like gifts and things for people so I won't show you those but I got a bunch of cards as well and I just like love their cards so much I, I usually just like stock up and then I run out and then I buy more so I got this one that says cultivate kindness this one that says yippee this one's one of my favorites it says you are lovely and this one says how lovely I just think these are the cutest cards ever and then the last one I got just has this little design and it says thank you and I thought it was absolutely beautiful and then I also got some other random things but they're for other people so I won't show you and then I went to collect because I haven't gone there in forever and I got two pairs of earrings because I haven't done that in a very long time and they had a sale on so these were like super super inexpensive as well but I like like dangly earrings and like statement earrings but not like really statement earrings so I got these ones which are like my favorite ones oh my gosh that's Georgia hello okay have fun okay yeah Bye. Not much. <laughs> that was Georgia and Brendan. Um, yeah. So I got these ones. They look like this. They're just like super, super simple, but I know I'm going to get so much wear out of them. And then I got these ones, which are really pretty as well. They look like this, and they have a little like baby pink tassel on them, and I thought they were so simple, but so cute. So that's what I got. Didn't spend a lot, but I had like a really good time, so... Yeah. Also, just like an FYI, I listened to Kanye's album, and you know what? It's not my favorite. I think Life of Pablo was honestly just iconic, and nothing can ever live up to Life of Pablo. So I feel privileged that I was able to experience Life of Pablo, but <sighs> yay is just like, mm, eh. Mm. It's not bad. It's just like not fantastic, you know? This is literally such a common occurrence in this household. <laughs> <laughs> Like, Look, she's got it covered. We take our Instagrams way too seriously, but I love it so much. It's actually so much fun. Like, I was thinking about it, yeah. and I was like, I don't really care about Instagram that much, but, like, taking the photos is so much fun. I've got nothing else to do with my time, guys. <laughs> but also, look how cool Georgia's jacket is, a.k.a. it's mine, but look how great it is. It's is it from? Pop Cherry. Okay, I need to tell everyone something. It looks so good on you, and it literally yeah. looks like... A blanket on me! So, we decided that we're having a little impromptu photo shoot this afternoon before I have to go to church. But uh, this is my second outfit. We just took a photo in the outfit that I was wearing and now I'm in this outfit and I'm in George's room. So, this little white top is from Princess Polly. This little like tie-up top is from Zaffle. These jeans are from Target. Belt is from City Beach. Not wearing any shoes right now because, uh, YOLO. And we're currently taking photos in our garage. Oh, she cute! <laughs> Brendan's so great because he tells you how to pose. We just went and shot like a bunch of photos and I totally didn't vlog a single thing because I'm dumb and I left my camera at home. But we're back now. I just changed into probably my last outfit. It is this, yeah, I've got a lot of stuff from Zaffle today. I just really like this stuff. I genuinely do. Um, this yellow dress from Zaffle. This um, denim jacket from H&M and just some white sneakers from Big W. I really don't have a lot of expensive clothes. Like I am balling on a budget and I love my outfits to be honest. Okay, let's go see what everyone's doing. We're taking more photos in the studio. <laughs> the garage. This is my filming room. Welcome. <laughs> We're using the stool that I got for my filming room and it's honestly just like great. Like it's really useful. Hi George's vlog. What's going on? How are you? I hope you're doing well. Okay, bye. Get in losers. We're going shopping. Slightly what? It came up slightly southern. Going shopping. Going shopping. We're gonna take some photos in a donut shop. <laughs> Vlog the bite. Oh, what a what a good bite! <laughs> My favorite type of photos are the ones with props that you get to eat once you finish the photos. So thank you, Donut Shop, for some great photos. We're going home now. Sit on the stool and pose. We've decided that you need to post something on your Instagram. So oh, this is what we've been doing all day. Is photos. When was the last time you posted on your Instagram, Isabel? <laughs> My birthday last year. September 2017. <laughs> so I actually didn't think I had that much footage, but it turned out that I did. So I didn't end the vlog because I thought it was going to continue, but 
it's ending right now, so I'm here to end it. If you guys want to see the pictures that we ended up taking, check out my Instagram. It is always linked in the description box, but otherwise it's just RachelCatherine998. And all the photos that Brendan, Georgia, and I took will be up on there. There's already some up there, so you can check those out if you want to see what the final product was. But other than that, I guess I'll see you guys in my next video very soon. Goodbye.